Cambridge Analytica was behind the defeat crooked Hillary campaign. And according to Hillary Clinton, that was a massive propaganda campaign. It wasn't just all about me. It was how to suppress voters who were inclined to vote for me. When you have a massive propaganda effort to prevent people from thinking straight because they're being flooded with false information. And you have people who are searching, trying to make sense of it, but every search engine, every site they go into is repeating these fabrications. Then yes, it affected the thought processes of voters. Well, like Mark Turnbull says, okay, all they needed to do was use information that was already out there to play on people's psychology. So the information said you can't be trusted, Hill Dog. So it turns out you were your own worst enemy. Okay, I mean, the video campaign didn't help, and neither did your emails or the DNC or your husband's policies. And look, for anybody that comes out and is like, oh, he's talking against Hillary, he must be pro-Trump. He's got to be pro-Trump. I'm not pro-Trump either. I don't like the guy. I don't like how he won either. And this is one of the ways that he won. I mean, Cambridge Analytica is basically the steroids of the American voting system. That's all it is. The only problem is you can't do a piss test to find out that people are doing it. These campaigns are then spread by activists, billionaire companies, super PACs, charity groups, and, and the videos go viral. And and so eventually it becomes really hard to find out the origin point of these campaigns. Yeah, at this point, we might as well just try to find the origin of the Big Bang before we find out where memes and viral videos started. It is slightly easier. Now, according to Steve Bannon, none of this is a big deal. Bannon believes that this is the left being sore losers. And Trump won because of his simplistic speech, which is a polite way of saying the American populace is dumb. And Trump used little words for a big win. That's what won it for you. Here's what won it for you. Here's what won it for Trump. Economic nationalism and talking in a plain voice to the American people. Okay. I think I've heard that record before, but... That happens to be the Just... But it is fair to say that this wasn't the only thing that resulted in the election. If memes are the sole reason we are manipulated to vote against the interests of humanity, then I don't think we're ready for the responsibility of voting or evolution. Let's let's just go back to the trees. In the same Channel 4 expose, Alexander Nix, the head honcho and boy wonder of Cambridge Analytica, says the candidate is just a puppet. So the candidate is the puppet? Always. Right, right, right. But in every election? Oh, nearly. So for Democrats, it's just like the summer grapes. They're saying yes. Which goes to show that technology and data companies drive election results. So Trump's simplistic rhetoric was just a ruse to an incredibly complicated scheme that could have only been concocted by old-timey weed. 